Hello and welcome to my channel Shifa's Kitchen. Today I am going to show you how to make wet jaipuri. So let's start. For this we have one onion, two tomatoes, half a cup of cashews and two green chilies. Then I have half a cup of green peas, half a cup of yellow bell pepper. Here you can use green capsicum or red capsicum. But I have the yellow one available. Then I have half a cup of cauliflower, half a cup of French beans, half a cup of carrots, and half a cup of potatoes, half a cup of paneer, two tablespoon of fresh cream. Here I have one teaspoon of red chili powder, one and a half teaspoon of cumin powder, one and a half teaspoon of coriander powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric. 1 4 teaspoon of garam masala powder, salt to taste. We have 1 teaspoon of kasuri methi or fenugreek leaves. I have 1 teaspoon each of ginger garlic paste. So let's start. First, in the mixy jar, I'll add green chilies, cashews, tomatoes, and onions. We will make a smooth paste out of it. As you can see, our paste is ready. It is smooth and fine. In the wok, I have heated up some oil and now I will fry my paneer, cut into cubes. A paneer has turned a bit brown, we will remove it in a bowl. And then we will fry a potatoes and carrots in the same oil our potatoes and carrots are done we will remove them in the bowl and then we will fry our cauliflower and beans our cauliflower and beans are done we will fry our peas and capsicum And remove them in the same bowl and we keep our veggies aside. In the same bowl, in the same oil, I let ginger garlic paste and we'll saute it for a minute. Then to this, I let paste of tomatoes, onions, green chilies, and cashews. Mix it, then to this I will add a spice with coriander powder, cumin powder, turmeric powder, red chili powder and salt and we will give it a mix and let it cook. As you can see the oil has started separating from our gravy now to this I will add all our fried veggies mix it and let it cook also to this we will add garam masala powder mix it and we will let it cook Now to this I will add almost 1 foot cup of water, mix it and let it cook. Now to this I will add fresh cream followed by kasuri methi of fenugreek leaves. Mix it and let it cook. Finally, to this, I will add and each of green coriander. Mix it, let it cook for a minute, and it is done. Red jaipur is ready. Top it with some crushed papad. If you like my recipe, please give a thumbs up. Also, if you create any of my recipes, don't forget to tag me on any of my social media accounts. Facebook and Instagram, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell icon, 
to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you.